Clay Aiken speaks out. For the first time, Clay's talking about the accusations that his charity isn't being all that charitable. Well, tonight, one of American Idol's biggest stars is setting the record straight on a charity controversy swirling around him. Clay Aiken is speaking about uh, speaking out about reports that his charity is not so giving. And you'll hear it here on Showbiz Tonight exclusively. Our Sabila Vargas is in Hollywood with the latest. What's the story with this, Sabila? Well, it all started when Clay Aiken's hometown station ran a report questioning how his nonprofit group is spending its donation. Now, those headlines were picked up by national media outlets, and the story got legs. Aiken says the station now backs him up, but he wants to clear the air once and for all. I call out your name. You don't hear a sound. Clay Aiken is hearing the sounds of criticism, and not for his music. Critics are saying his charity, the Bubel Aiken Foundation, which is set up to benefit children with disabilities, could be, well, more charitable. Aiken's charity raised more than a million dollars last year, but critics point out that less than a third of that money went towards grants to individuals or outside organizations. For the first time on camera, Aiken is defending his charity exclusively on Showbiz Tonight. He says a distinction should be made between grants and direct services programs. We're not a grant-giving organization, so that we do spend less than one-third on grants is true. We do spend less than one-third on grants, but over a half of our money, in addition to that, goes to programs like summer camps, able to serve programs, uh, youth service programs. Aiken told Showbiz Tonight an independent accountant looked into their numbers, and according to Aiken, his organization charitably spends 85 cents of every dollar raised. He says that's right in line with other nonprofits. Aiken told Showbiz Tonight the negative media reports were frustrating. It's just kind of a, a disappointing thing because you'd, you'd hope that people would get the entire story and people would want the entire story, but it's been a, it's been a disappointing thing that I've learned in the past three years that people are more interested in sensationalism than they are with getting the facts. But the publicity was not all bad. Aiken told Showbiz Tonight his charity is coming out on top. After that story came out, we've probably raised more money in the past five days than we did in the entire previous two months. So I think most people are understanding that we are, you know, they realize that what we're doing is, is, is appropriate. We have a good cause. But Daniel Borikoff, president of the American Institute of Philanthropy, told Showbiz Tonight, be careful with celebrity charities. Too often it's happened too many times. We wasted too many charitable dollars uh, giving money to celebrity-oriented organizations that really haven't amounted to much. There's a lot of hoopla, a lot of excitement at the beginning, but unfortunately a lot of times they fizzle out and uh, uh, we, this is not a good use of our charitable money. Well, Americans certainly love Clay Aiken. His jukebox tour kicks off in New Jersey this Thursday. It's his fifth tour since American Idol and has him singing some 70-odd songs from five decades. Everything from Sam Cooke to Barry Manilow to the Bee Gees and the Goo Goo Dolls. His tour ends September 1st. AJ, back to you. Thanks very much, Sabila. Showbiz Tonight, Sabila Vargas, live in Hollywood.